of foams or fomite is any object or substance capable of carrying infectious organisms, such as germs or parasites, and hence transferring them from one individual to another. Skin cells, hair, clothing, and bedding are common hospital sources of contamination. Fomites are associated particularly with hospital-acquired infections, as they are possible routes to pass pathogens between patients. Stethoscopes and neckties are do such fomites associated with healthcare providers. Basic hospital equipment, such as four drip tubes, catheters, and life support equipment can also be carriers, when the pathogens form biofilms on the surfaces. Careful sterilization of such objects prevents cross-infection. Researchers have discovered that smooth surfaces like doorknobs transmit bacteria and viruses better than porous materials like paper money because porous, especially fibrous, materials absorb and trap the contagion, making it harder to contract through simple touch. Etymology The Italian scholar and physician Girolamo Fracastoro appears to have first used the Latin word foams, meaning tinder, in this sense in his essay on contagion. To contagion a contagiosis small bees published in 1546, by foams I mean clothes, wooden objects, and things of that sort, which though not themselves corrupted can, nevertheless, preserve the original germs of the contagion and infect by means of these. English usage of foams, pronounced, is documented since 1658. The English word for might, which has been in use since 1859, is a back formation from the plural formites. The English language pronunciation of formites is, while the singular, formite, is pronounced. In popular culture, formites play a conspicuous role in Steven Soderbergh's 2011 film Contagion about a pandemic. See also, focal infection theory, focus of infection, nosocomial infection, vector. References External links Discussion on language log, general characteristics and roles of formites in viral transmission.